Hello. Hello guys. I wanted to start vlogging today because we are going to attempt target trip number two. I want to get her a, it's called the Fisher Price Sit Me Up seat. I want to go and get her that. And I want to maybe get some things for myself. I think I just need like foundation and looking good again. Foundation and like some nail polish maybe. And that's it. And we're good looking for you. Yeah? What do you think? I have a new hair color again today. <laughs> Every day it's a new hair color. <laughs> well, I bleached my hair, then I toned it, and now I turned it uh, gray, which is pretty cool. I've always seen other, what are you doing? I've always seen other, what are you doing? Whoa, 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 whoa. I've always seen other uh, girls with gray hair, and it's such an unachievable color that I wanted to try it and I got it. The only way you can get gray hair is if you bleach your hair like no one's business and then it's white enough to take a gray hair dye. It's one of those things in my life that I never really achieved a light enough blonde to get gray hair, so <gasps> what do you think? And I finally have, and when I noticed that my hair was light enough and super light, I was like, I'm gonna dye my hair gray. I think I can do it. And I did. I mean, it's, it's uneven. There's still like some blonde, like there's parts of it you could actually probably see right here. Like there's parts of it that are like a blue and then there's other parts that are like a, still a blonde, like a, it's almost like a green blonde. It's kind of weird. But you, yeah, you could probably tell him. Maybe. In here. And probably in better lighting. You can kind of, even like maybe up here, you can see that it's not really gray. I mean, it's gray, but it's like a greeny. Yes. It's like a greeny blonde. But still. It's still gray. Huh? What do you think? Say hello. Oh. We're doing a new thing of kicking. Oh, we have just discovered, we have just discovered that we can kick. Uh, so that is, look at that. What are you doing with all the, oh gosh darn it. What are you doing with all these? What is this? What are those? Not as cute. Whoa. car seat uh, because she hates the car seat and two uh, I want to get her out more and get more comfortable about going out like 
Oh, see, Riley. You're okay, baby. Like, she hates the car seat, so the more I put her in it and the more we drive around, I think she'll be a little bit more comfortable in it. Uh, again, she's only two months, so we have plenty of time to get used to it. But I figured, you know, start now. And uh, last time we used the car seat in the stroller, and she hates the car seat. So putting her in the stroller and then going around Target, obviously she hated it because she hates the car seat. I just figured maybe with the surroundings it would distract her and she'd be fine. I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. I was I was just hoping really. So I have I have the Moby wrap already wrapped on. I know baby. Already oh gosh, it's gonna fall. I have the Moby wrapped already wrapped on. So when we get there, I can literally just like pop her in. I don't have to she doesn't have to sit in the car seat and wait for me to put it on. I try to make this as easy as possible. So, and we can abort mission at any time. This is literally, like, I want to go shopping and get her some things and get myself some things. I think I mentioned earlier. But if at any point I think that this is going south very fast, we can always just leave and go home. I don't have to buy anything. We can literally just walk around Target if that's what she wants. If I don't have time to, like, check out and like buy something that's fine everything that i want to get will be there anytime so that she ate right before we left. She had a full tummy. She had a clean diaper. And I put her in the wrap and bounced her all the way through Target and it worked great. It just, oh, I'm so glad. I bought, um, in the clip previously to this, you saw that little seat. It's like a sit-up seat and then it has like a little tr uh, toy tray or whatever. I bought that and I got some nail polish and some foundation and a bottle brush as well. So that's awesome. I'm super excited that that worked out so well. Hey guys, so we are back from Target and she is down for her nap that she is kind of just waking up for now. She's moving around on the monitor and you can you might actually be able to see her. Probably not, it's right there in the corner. But she did really well and I wanted to show you guys what I got at Target. got this munchkin uh, bottle bottle cleaner because I didn't have any troubles cleaning her bottles and I just started pumping again so cleaning the pump parts has been kind of a hassle so um, I got this in hopes that because I've been trying to clean the bottles myself by hand and it's not really working out. Well, yeah, 
I try to put it down not being swaddled and that didn't really work. It never does. I think maybe one day it will, but usually it doesn't. Um, so I bought, got this bottle cleaner and I got the Elf Foundation. I used to use the Elf Foundation Sand. Um, oh, new name, same color. Maybe I should have gotten the other one. Usually I use sand from e.l.f. for their foundation. It's actually, you would think it's crappy, but it's not that bad. Um, but because they changed the names, I figured they changed the color and the formula. Um, this says porcelain. Porcelain is usually too light for me. I'm not really sure why I did that. But I'm super pale, so maybe it's a good thing. And, oh, I don't have it with me, but I bought the um, Orly, it's like a neon pink Orly nail polish, and I did my toes. I did my toes with it just like a minute ago. I like the color. I think it turned out pretty well. So I bought that, and I bought the Method All-Purpose Naturally Derived Surface Cleaner in pink. Great food. I wanted a cleaner that was going that I could use with all of Lily's baby stuff because like her mat she spits up on and some of her toys can get dirty and I haven't cleaned them yet because I don't know the cleaners that we have are okay to use with baby stuff and I'm just kind of worried about like chemicals being around her. Um, so Tasha Henderson Pretty sure that's her name. I wanted to look it up before I did this, but uh, I didn't have time. Uh, but I watch Tasha Henderson here on YouTube. Uh, I'm sure you guys know who she is. She's a mom here on YouTube that has two daughters, and I'm obsessed with her channel. And she talks about the method cleaner. And so when I was at Target today looking for a cleaner, I saw the Target had all almost all the method cleaning line. So I wanted to buy it and test it out. And she uses it around her house and I'm pretty sure she uses it with her baby stuff. So I wanted to get it and test it out myself. So that's everything I got. And we got this too. I'll show it to you in a minute. It's in her room, but let's go get her. Thank you. 